Hello beautiful and handsome faces, welcome back to my channel. Shout out to all my new and my old subscribers. If you haven't subscribed yet, please click somewhere down below. It is free. I do subscribe back. Your girl really would appreciate that. Now, um, this video is going to be a wig um, review video, wig show and tell, um, whatever you want to call it, but I call them wig reviews. But anyways, and I have like a little small mini haul. It's many, many, many or whatever and I decided to show y'all these products because I'm on a budget like a real budget because my hours at my job has been dropped a whole lot so your girl really is budgeting now so I know for a fact that I wasn't gonna buy no more makeup like that so I said let me just include this little stuff that I got in this wig review so um I'm gonna start with the Dollar Tree I got this from the Dollar Tree like probably about a week or so ago and I just picked up two items, and they buy Milani. I picked up this Milani Crystal Eyes Sparkling Eyeshadow. It's in number three, Stunning and Sparkly. It's the gold one. I picked it. I was excited to see this one because I have these two already that I bought before from the Dollar Tree. So I don't know how many um, colors there are, but this is one. This is number two, and then I got the number three, which is a gold color. This is what it looks like. Um, basically, it's the same as the other ones. The pack is very cute. You open it, and that's what the the applicator looks like. You just squeeze it out, and it come off as you putting you know glitter on top of your you know eyeshadow, or you could wear it by itself or whatever. And then I picked up this Milani Crystal Lip Gloss. This is just clear. This is what it looks like. To add to my collection, I have a whole bunch of these in different colors. Well, not a whole bunch, but I have enough in different colors. So I picked up the clear one. And I got those two items from the Dollar Tree. Y'all know it's only a dollar. So I went to CVS um, because I had $3 extra bucks that I wanted to use before they expire. So I picked up the NYC, what is this, Liquid Lip Shine Lip Gloss. I picked up two of them. And y'all, I didn't pay anything for it. It came up to like, it was buy one, get one half off. So it came up to like $2.98. And I had my um, $3 extra bucks, so I ended up not paying nothing. Like, it went straight through. So this one is in Cities Clear. It's just a clear lip gloss. You know, I didn't need any more lip gloss, but I needed to spend my extra bucks. So I just picked that up. And then the uh, second one I got is Fashion Avenue Fuchsia. It's like a pink color. I'm not going to swatch these on my lips for the sake of the video. I really don't want the video to be that long. So, yeah, that's the mini haul. I'm trying my best not to pick up no more makeup. I'm not going to say try my best. I'm not going to pick up no more makeup because I got to save every panty. Y'all know what I'm talking about. Anyways, moving on to this wig review. Um, I only seen, I did my research. I went, okay, let me start over. I went to the beauty supply store today and I seen a wig that caught my eye. And those of you who know me and watch my videos, I've always said that I'm trying to stray away from human hair wigs because they're just extremely too expensive. They're out my budget now, so I really can't do too much of human hair right now. So I've been straying away to the synthetic wigs that has that, that have that human-like texture and you're able to curl it, like this one. This is uh, Wig Bora and Jet Black, and she's just like human hair. So anyways... Came across this wig. I only seen one wig review on YouTube. I think her her YouTube is a uh, what is it? Uh, I'd have forgot her. Damn, I'm sorry. I'd have forgot. It was on the tip of my tongue, but I I honestly forgot. I think it's Diva Diva Fashion Diva TV. If I'm saying it right, hey girl, Fashion Diva TV. I seen her do a wig review on this exact wig, but a different color. And I didn't see any more um, reviews after her, so just one. But anyways, it's the Free Trust Equal um, Lace Deep Invisible L Part Wig, and it's in heaven. Um, I got the color OM2730613. Y'all know I'm a color girl. I wear it all. I don't care. But this is what the package looked like. Sorry about my light, y'all, but this is what the package looked like. Okay. Now, I know y'all like, okay, if she on a budget, why she buying wigs? Now, this was a gift. 
um, someone actually bought this for me. So that was very nice of that person. That person know who I'm talking about. And I thank you for that. So, yeah. So this is a gift. It, you know, I, it was a gift. So, yeah. So this is the wig. And I was excited to get it. It was so nice of that person to do that for me. Yeah. So, <laughs> all right. Back to this wig review. But anyways, the color I said is OM273613. This is what she looks like. So, I'm going to go ahead and... And I literally just got home, y'all, from the beauty supply store from getting this. Because this is the only color they had. It was on the mannequin. So, yeah. And she packaged it up real nicely for me. It come in a box like this. And I think this is like the newest one they came out with. And it's the L part. They got the little picture right there. It comes with the net on it. And also the tag or whatnot. And it's a lace wig. You got the stuffing. And I have fell in love with this color or whatever. Excuse me, y'all. My camera really got red. Excuse that. But um, this is the tag. That's what it looks like. Look at her. Isn't she gorgeous? She is a gorgeous model. And on the back, it just has the take care instructions as usual. And this is the color. Look at that color, y'all. I have a this wig in this exact same color. So, And like I said, this was on the mannequin. And when I say this wig is thick, it's very thick. I said lit. I don't even know what I said. But it's very thick, y'all. And I love it. That's what the color looks like on the bottom. All right. So it has the L part. There's the L part right there. I'm going to put some concealer or some powder in there. It has the lace. The lace is hard lace, but it's not that um i don't know how to describe it it's not as hard as the other lace that come on those hard lace wigs if i said that correctly but that's the inside it has two combs in the front that's the l part right there it has the adjustable straps in the back it has a comb in the back and that's the tag and yeah oh and it's big head friendly y'all because y'all know i got a round head and my head is huge so yeah it's big head friendly and this is the one I tried on at the beauty supply store. So, she said she had just got it off the um out the pack. It looks like she just got it out the pack. Nobody has really played with it, so I had to get it. So what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna cut the lace. I'm gonna cut the string and put some concealer in the parts, and I'll be right back. All right, ladies, this is the wig. When I say I love this wig, I am in love with this damn wig. Excuse my language. Um, like I said, when I tried it on in a beauty supply store, I was like, man, I got to get this wig. <laughs> I can't order it offline. It would have been a little cheaper offline. I got to get it. So, um, hold on, y'all. Somebody calling me. Anyways, but... Um, I was going to ask, you know, that person who got me this wig to order it online, but either way, it would have came out the same price. But anyways, um, I must say, I love this wig. I really love this wig. Um, I meant to tell you, it has bendable tabs on the side. That's what I like about this um, lace wig, because sometimes you get lace wigs and they don't have the bendable tabs. And the bendable tabs is helping a lot. And I like the way this wig fit. Now, it fit my head perfectly. Like, the tabs come directly down towards my ears. It's not too tight. It's not too loose. I love it. I love the color and everything. This is the lace that I cut off. Okay? In pieces, y'all. Because I was taking my time and I was scared to cut the lace. I'm not a professional at cutting lace fronts because... I'm just getting to wearing lace front wigs. But anyways, I use for my part. Look how realistic that look, y'all. Y'all see that? And for my part, I use this um, Maybelline Fit Me Foundation in 320. Not my color. But um, <laughs> I used it for the part. And it worked fine to my liking or whatever. I did a little method, um, uh, Miss Fashion Diva TV. When I watched her um, wig review on this wig, she put the foundation up under the wig, not on top, and it bled right through. 
I kind of like that method better. So, yes, ma'am. I'm loving this wig. And this is all lace, ear to ear lace. This is the lace. I, I cut it. I didn't cut too much off. I still got some lace there, but you can't see it. But this is the lace. It's all the way to the ear. You can actually pull this wig back if you wanted to. And this is the other side. Y'all see that? Ear to ear. And the tabs is bendable. And you can lay it down. You can actually pull it back. But I'm not. So, and like I said, this wig is very full. Fresh out the pack. Well, it was on a mannequin, but it was still fresh out the pack. Have not curled it. It say you can curl it. Where's the thing at? Okay. <laughs> I am feeling myself with this wig, y'all. Love it. Uh, you can curl this wig up to 400 degrees. Yeah. I think it's... Yeah, it's a higher temperature than the wig. Excuse me, I burnt. That was nasty. It was. It's a higher temperature than wig borer that I always be, you know, been rocking or whatever. But anyways, this is her. Love, love, love it. I really can't turn around. Let me see if I can turn around because I'm not in the chair that maneuver. Let me see. If y'all can see that, I don't know. Y'all see all the body she has? If y'all can see that. Don't know if y'all can see that, but yes, ma'am, I love it. And I'm not going to be putting no heat to this wig yet. I'm not even going to use a comb. Now, with the shedding, I got minimum shedding. You know, I got some shedding as I was cutting the lace because I cut some hair. And um, as I'm running my fingers through, I can't talk, y'all. I'm so excited. As I'm running my fingers through this wig, I'm not, I got one string. Nothing too serious, y'all. So, but. Yeah, I must say, I love this wig. I'm in love. Would I purchase another one? Yeah, when my money get right. But um, y'all know I keep it real. I don't care. In the long run, I will be purchasing some more of these wigs. But when I say the quality and the texture of this wig feels just like permed African-American hair, love it. I love the swoop. Over oh, this big forehead of mine, you know, got to cover that up. But anyways, this video is too long. I'm being silly. Hope y'all have a great weekend. Hope y'all Memorial Day is awesome. So, yeah, I guess I'm going to end this video with a kisses. Until next time. Bye.